So uh, this is the uh, Santa Barbara Center for Art, Science, and Technology. It's an art architectural rendering before the project was built. And <clears throat> the stand acronym is SBCAST, as in cast of characters, or casting about for solutions, or casting metal. So it's a, this is a live work designer community in Santa Barbara. It's a, also an incubator. It consists of full-time working artists, and there's an emphasis on technical arts, collaborative opportunities, strong relationship with existing arts organizations, and there's mentoring and other educational um, opportunities there. So art, art, SPCAST is partially about art, and art is really this idea of communicating a feeling, namely a subjective experience, in addition to these other things that are like listed here. And um, science is really about uh, co communication of, um, of objective experience, and and it's also about guidance and discipline, and the method of communication is, is, is uh, highly structured, unlike the situation with artistic communication. And then finally, technology. These are, uh, technology is just a tool, and it's tools that ex expend our, uh, extend our uh, personal ability, our physical ability and reach, and also our, our perceptual systems, it's technology. So these things are all connected. Uh, so this idea that art provides incentive for action, that science uh, provides kind of guidance and discipline, and then technology is this kind of tangible result that creates a new platform for artists and scientists to go about their work. So I, I like to think of these things in terms of mythological stories, and this is the story of Blind Orion, uh, and Sedalion and blind Orion is, represents the artist who's like looking to restore his eyesight and Sedalion is his technology that's telling him which way to go and the path is this scientific process and here is, is Sarah is looking for her daughter uh, Persepina and she's using the torches to find her way in the darkness to find her daughter and she's beseeching Jupiter to provide guidance in terms of which way to go. This kind of idea of like artist, scientist, technologist. This idea is not new. These are many examples of this kind of thing worldwide. In base camp, in um, in Philadelphia, I beam in New York City, Machine Project in L.A., and V2 Rotterdam. Um, many other examples too of this kind of idea of like fusing these things. So SBCAST is unique for Santa Barbara. It's the, the closest multidisciplinary designer communities are still right now in Los Angeles and San Francisco. SBCAST, the hope is to be, it would be a cultural arts asset for Santa Barbara. And we'll spin off prototypes and we'll also help establish Santa Barbara's reputation as a kind of harbinger of such things. There'll be seven full-time artists and designers working there. There's two studios for artists in residence. Be. And then it's kind of a collaborative space uh, for prototyping, high-end tools, demos. Residents will be involved with mentoring. It's also located in the MODA, which is the mobility-oriented development area for Santa Barbara. This is an extension of the Arts Corridor along Garden Street. SPCAS is located at 513 Garden. There's three bus routes with a block and a half, and the Crosstown Electric Shuttle is right there, too. Um, its construction and location, uh, again, and, and also its positioning in the MODA, pays special uh, credence to this, uh, the principles associated with AB32, SB97, and SB375, which are all California legislation related to greenhouse gas reduction. This is, these are extracts from the Santa Barbara General Plan, and that area in the purple is the MODA, and SBCAST is located in that, the mobility-oriented development area. And all these subsequent slides are all pulled from the Santa Barbara General Plan. SBCAST is an um, example realization of attempting to put aspects of the plan into practice. So strength and mobility options, affordable housing, this idea of like residential living in commercial areas, connectivity and civic engagement, encouraging the use of bicycles. 
um, establishing artists live workspace, the contribution to the city economy is played by the arts, and then also um, this kind of like mix of land uses and kind of a focus on cultural arts in the moda also as well. And um, so attention to recycled materials and this kind of idea also of linking mixed use developments to transit lines and encouraging use of the bicycle. And, uh, and then finally, this idea of encouraging closer ties with, um, with UCSB and other educational institutions inside of Marlboro, like City College. And then finally, green roofs and this idea of like sort of urban farms and um, this uh, also kind of thinking a little bit more about the use of technology in, um, in local businesses and enterprises. And, uh, and then finally, this kind of more focus to AB 32 and SB 375, kind of thinking a little bit more about reduction in greenhouse gas emissions related to like, you know, minimizing the use of the car and also kind of enhancing the use of renewable resources like uh, solar thermal systems and photovoltaic arrays. And then this is an example of the completed project right here. These are the kind of pictures. It's just right now undergoing a soft opening. All right, thank you very much. Yeah.